This is a horrible tragedy, and it's one that's preventable. King 5 asked attorney William Kirk about what consequences the family and 18-year-old sibling who reportedly brought that gun into the home might face. Kirk specializes in cases involving gun ownership. What the law does make clear is that if you fail to secure a firearm, if you leave it unattended where it could be accessed by unauthorized people and then bad things happen, such as what happened in this case, then yeah, you can be held criminally liable for that. He's referring to the unsafe storage of a firearm section of a state gun law known as Initiative 1639. Penalties can range from a misdemeanor to a felony charge known as community endangerment due to unsafe storage. Kirk points out two factors in the instance of the federal way shooting. Could be on the hook also for community endangerment in the first degree. That too is a class C felony. And secondly, if we're talking about a handgun, an 18 year old in very limited circumstances can actually be in possession of a handgun. The law does not specify how exactly gun owners need to secure their firearms, but they do need to be somehow stored safely. When we have young children in the home, the reality of the situation is that firearm does present a danger if the firearm is left unsecured. Again, at last check, no charges have been filed. Also, this is still an active investigation. Live in Seattle, I'm Christine Pei, King 5 News.